Hello everybody, welcome to CCL Season 53, Round 16. We've got Nepruha with his Skaven and a Wizard up against Mad Jake with his Orcs. Um, quite a nice Orc team from Mad Jake. And I believe it's not the best Skaven team ever. Pretty unexciting gutters, yeah, unexciting gutters. But they've got a Wizard and anything can happen with Skaven and a wizard. Also, it looks like there's no ball... Oh, no, the ball carrier is just out of range. That's weird, isn't it? That's weird to leave your ball out of range. Why wasn't the ball carrier... Oh, because of the wizard. Hmm. Hmm. The problem is if you don't... If you don't carry... as fuck. Thanks, Steve. The problem is if you don't carry on the... Um, if you don't carry on the dedicated carrier, then you might just run in and strip you anyway. Glorious. If he scores no, I won't the give in. Until I victorious. A wrestler, and I will defend. I will Look defend. Dog. Oh, and he's got Juggernaut. Does he? Yeah, Hello, Jim. Nearly five years. That's fair enough. Unbelievable. Thank you very much. Audrey Dolly, nearly 15 who will be the pregnancies. Also known as five years. Unbelievable. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. And Owl Skuro. Man, do you know what? I wish I could be playing War Tales. Everyone's playing War Tales now. I want to play War Tales and I want to play CCL. But I'm just doing art really slowly because I'm bad at it. Well, I'm not bad at it. I'm terrible at it. Yeah, Mr. Yemendem gifted me it years ago. Well, not years ago, probably last year. When I was playing uh, Battle Brothers. So I didn't. I didn't play it because I was playing Battle Brothers. <laughs> yeah, from every like, Fimi is obsessed by it, isn't he? Fimi is obsessed by it. Everyone seems to love it. But, um... Four-person co-op, glorious. <laughs> Oh, there's also Barotrauma. I want to play Barotrauma. What I've been doing is I've just been hanging out in the voice chat. Uh, Elliot, HTK, Dimmy, Jack Bull, Hancock. They've all been playing it. I've just been in the I've just been in the voice chat while I've been doing my art listening to them. Because <laughs> it's hilarious. <laughs> Mm, that's what I thought, honestly, CPG. Like, I didn't want to buy it because I thought it'll be a fad that by the time I buy it, they'll have given up. <laughs> What's this door? That might be the safe. Front's a bit weak here, isn't it? This seems inviting too much pressure on. Maybe it's a trap, but that seems really, um... Really, like, you know, it could have jammed in hard up here, but isn't going to. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. Multiplayers, like, kind of stay fresh forever, don't they? Because it's versus each other. So, like, even something as simple as kicking a ball around stays fresh forever. Whereas, um... Single player video games. Well, not a single, but PVE. Gets staler, doesn't it? I think, even obviously. World of Warcraft's gone on forever, hasn't it? And, uh, Minecraft's gone on forever. And they've been talking shit. But I don't know. Just feels like. But this. Yeah, there's still multiplayer in a way. Which Barotrauma is. Most people don't do it though, do they? They just do the raids. Like Diablo is kind of similar, isn't it? Just versus PvE all the time. Even though you can do PvP.
Well, he's banging people out. Wizard. Probably too far away from these two guards to do anything. I'm going to nail it with steel sheet using your bollocks. Fair enough. Not a fan then. <laughs> Loved it. <laughs> yep, decal. Yeah, it's brutal. It's, it's really brutal. It's amazing how hard it is to just look at. <laughs> For like a long time. Like it's okay for a game or whatever. But like you don't want to keep looking at it because it hurts. Kind of makes sense to go for the strength four when he could. Um, you know, maybe he could have blitzed this guy and then would have, could have got to both of these, but sneakily got this gutter up hanging out over here. Oh, and this is the problem, right? Goes for the sack. Goes for the strip sack without the whistle. And now, if he rolls god dice, it's over. Not even that crazy, right? Some twos, some threes. Didn't roll the threes. Yeah. I guess... Nah, I, I don't know. I didn't like it. I prefer to carry on the carrier. Man. You get bolted, you get bolted. Nearly cost me versus Rick with my high elves and I carried it on a bolt bait and then he just sacked me and then you know if I'd carried it on my actual ball carrier, the wizard's the only way he can win. But instead I you know I nearly went one mil down with him still having the wizard. Which is obviously an absolute disaster. Interesting to bring the gutter here back to get hit and cast. <laughs> I quite liked hanging out on the other side of the pitch, but there you go. There's the apple gone. Here, can you? Wow, he does the four three. Wait, so yeah, I didn't understand this going here instead of like one or two further forward. So he serves his pommer, that was real bad. Did he run out of time? Steps I can't surf this guy. Could surf the uh, strength four here. And I guess he. Oh, maybe he's not gonna. Surely you just surf the strength four. Oh, 
weird. Weird to not just surf the strength fall, if you ask me. This game got banged out. It's a high TV ox. High TV orcs that aren't caught by Jimmy Fantastic tend to kick the shit out of me. Oh man. I guess by not going surf, he does get to foul with Dirty Player. Which is pretty nice. Instant three. Instant bigger foul. There is the one turn the way. Potential one turn. Only one stun firm. Wow. It's looking pretty bad for the rats. <laughs> Two gutters. No, only one gutter. The other gutter got apple. So only one only one gutter cares. And to be fair, he hasn't really got very good gutters anyway, so. Well the problem is the wizard not being used. Well, like, obviously, you know, if you're going to end the half 1-0 down, it's better that you haven't used your wizard, but really would have wanted to use his wizard to go 1-0 up. Oh, there you go, that's it, probably... Probably GG. Nobody knows. That's not probably GG, is it? There is the one turn. And to be fair, he's only down a bit of quality, isn't he? It's only one go. Look, it's good to have eleven for the second half. So it's not. It's not over. Don't say it's over. Disagree with the analysis there from Big Chi Chi. I mean, the half was pretty one sided, but only one cut her out. These two might come back, could still have 11, could one turn, could Daka, and then win the toss. Guys, the dauntless that fails <laughs> and skulls. <laughs> not the not the best one turn attempt you've ever seen in your life. But you know, if you got the initial push, it would have just been a hit with him in 1 4, then a hit there in 1 forward. So it would have, have actually been pretty easy if you'd got the uh, initial push. So yeah, we've got 11 versus 11. And, you know, dirty player doesn't really matter, so just down one gutter for alignment.
And they've got a wizard, so they could potentially use the wizard to get the 8 turn stall and go for the 50-50 to win the game. Mm, Reroll of Dauntless. But the, I think the rest of the the rest of the one turn is so hard. But yeah, you need pushes. Like you actually need pushes, don't you? Your pals aren't good enough. Yeah, you probably probably did need to reroll the pushes. Yeah. Probably did need to reroll the Dauntless. So probably did need to reroll the Dauntless. Yeah. Could quick score and wish to turn over, but I'd rather try a Dakar and grind a half on. Now we've got some herb dirt base base basing. Which might force his hand in the quick score, we'll see. Quick score and wizard on defence isn't isn't terrible obviously. I'm way too tired to be doing this by the way, holy shit. Huh. This might just be one to do. Decent skull. Reroll gone with overtime possibility. I'm not sure you should use your reroll. Like, I'm not sure that's the correct turn ordering if you're going to use one of your three rerolls, where the only way you can win with overtime. It was about being busy all day and I thought I've got to do them, you know. I guess I'll just do them tomorrow. A bit early tomorrow. Oh, and there's a dodge fail. Yeah, this is uh, this is just more of a standard Skaven offense, right? We're just battling to have anything good happen. Seen many a time this kind of Skaven offense. All the line rats get based. You run around with your gutters and hope they win you the game. Oh, so tired. Sorry, I'm just so tired. I'll do my best to uh, to do something. <laughs> Juggernaut here, lovely. So defenseless 3D. You know, maybe they didn't need to make it 3D, right? Um, maybe there were better spares he could have gone to. Cause... But on the other hand, 3D in the gutter is really nice. I don't know why this uh, Rattler isn't like in that square. It seems way better to actually have him in that square. I really don't know what the plan is for the Skaven. Hold your opponent. Internet goes out. Woof. Right far forward. Oh man. This is a nice solution though, isn't it? Reliant on that three plus storage, but that's a really good, a really good turn from the Pruha. And because he put these two assists in over here, he doesn't have two players here to like, you know, get a surf to chain him on the ball or whatever. Just doesn't have any players to react and, and maybe making that a 3D did cost him.
I like getting these guys back, but could be too little too late. I'm gonna get the new seven back as far, far as possible as well. Three, four, five, six, seven. Get the new seven back to here. Stand the other guy up. And they're gonna have another turn, I think. I mean, yeah. He has to use the rerun as well. So. install a couple of turns because like it's re just super risky right because they with overtime being the realistic best they can hope for you know, I don't want to use rerolls here but I mean what's this it's just a one two three four five six seven eight Like going for this one, one, two, three, four, five, six, or so three, two, two to two D. I guess you just don't use a reroll. Maybe, maybe it's maybe you can use a reroll even. Right, the problem is what happens when you even get there, right? Even if you hit him and power him, it's just. Uh, He's not going for it. Oh, you can't re-roll that. I'll do that well. I don't dislike the re-roll. I absolutely despise it. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, I hate that re-roll. So now he's got two, two dice at this. And even if he fails them, it's just a two plus anyway. I mean, he's going to have to score now. You would think. Maybe not, though, right? Because he's got two 2 plus dodges off and he makes them both. He's got a uh, he's got a bit of a cage. So maybe he is going to go for the stall here. Yep, yeah, not blitzing that guy. Another turn of stall. Okay, maybe now he'll score. I thought he was going to bring the blitzer there and then just dodge off the ball carry around the other gutter. Get another turn of stall, but I guess the turn of stall might not even be that good with the wizard right now. He's got four turns to turn him on one score. Which is possible. Yeah, it's funny, isn't it? They got banged out pretty hard in the first half. Took three cows and like three or four kills, but ultimately Apple worked. Only down one gutter. And uh, yeah, it's still got a team. Very anti blitz from Mad Jake. Love, it. Love to see the anti blitz defense versus Rats. But, like, Entire anti blitz as well, totally covered against the worst possible kicks that you can't do anything about. People love to say, but turns out you can. Hello, Veron. Dean, we juggernauting the wrestler. The old 
chain. And a Kaz. Whoa. I wonder if he should have, uh, I don't know if he had the movement. This guy should have stood here, right? So if that was a push, he could have pushed him there and he would have had another 2D. Ah, they're all right. They can obviously do rap BS with multiple re-rolls. One turn's got better. Um, fouling's got better. Must gave him like fouling in one turn. Claw pump nerf hurts them a tiny bit. But then they benefit from it a bit as well. Now I'm ordered the uh, the classic rap defense of just not defending at all is like is what Muldrips used to do pretty much all the time, right? On on his defense, just don't bother playing the ball, just blitz somebody, gang foul them. And that's way better for Skaven than it is for anybody else. And that kind of strategy is encouraged by uh, massively encouraged by Blood Bowl 2020 rules. Oh, in comes the bolt. A ball scatter over there. Yep, frees up the... Uh, this is tremendously weak by... Um, by Mad J. Like, obviously, he's kind of lucky to take the first hit there. He could have... Wow, okay, unlucky to get cast, but... He could have been gone for the first hit, right? And there's four players here. I guess four here, technically, but it could have freed him. If he had to. And yep, now he's got an obstructed. I mean, that was a really good scatter as well. Well, I guess 50%. Oh. Good night and fight with back on. Yeah, it's really, it's really late, isn't it? I don't know. It wasn't even tired when I started this, and then I started it, and I'm just shattered. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know why that happened. Let's see, tag the wrestler, the rock, rockler. A sure feet this GFI, Diddle going mad. A re rollless GFI. Oh man. But I mean, this is pretty sick, isn't it? That was way too weak. Too many men on field because I could push them for the score, right? But. You needed like at least one more, like here or something, shoring up the cage. Gets the dodge, gets the hit, but can't use another reroll on the hit. And, uh, well, there you go. The rats didn't need overtime. <laughs> Flip me. Wiz comes in and that's that. But yeah, I guess that that's it. He just made it. Just short enough that magic did overcommit a little bit to the getting forward, right? Got to choose between safety and penetration. Tilted too far into penetration. Gave up that bit of safety. Very well taken advantage of by Nipruha. But there you go, yeah. Flipping rats. Disgusting, aren't they? Rats are pretty disgusting. I don't know if it's worth like just double GFing with this guy somewhere, because like okay he's probably gonna fail, but Well it's not probably going to. 70% of the time it doesn't fail. But like you don't, you're not getting much out of double GFing with him. But also You know, maybe you just should to like maybe it has an impact, maybe it helps to stop the stall. But then even if it does, you've still only got one turn left anyway, so... Like, he could just score here. Not going to. 
But maybe he could have just. And if he had GFI two down, then we'd have a five four. One, two, three, four, one. One, two, three, four, double G if I had to pace the ball. Okay, so I couldn't have hit. One, two, three, four, five. So this guy can hit. One, two. I can pause it. One, two, three, four, five, G if I do. If I saw it, it'd be a four, four, three. I mean, you've got to do it. As terrible as it is, you have to do it. Possibly leaves you a chance of winning the game. It fails. And that is that. Barring a riot into a two turn touchdown for the Orbs. Wow. Classic. Classic Skaven game, eh? Not really an impressive Skaven team. Didn't defend on defense in the first half. Second half, they barely got the score. You know, they were on the ropes on their offensive drive. And then a little bit of an overcommit by Mad Jake to three dice. A defenseless gutter, which he really, you know, probably didn't need to, right? If he'd had those two in cover instead, maybe he could have got more more chance of stopping the touchdown. And then, yeah, the classic. Too far, too much into penetration, not enough into safety. And it's hard, right? It's hard versus escaping with a wizard, but still. You know, it's, more, it's not really a criticism, just an observation. And, uh, yeah, that's, that's that. It's funny, isn't it, rats? I do feel like rats cost me a chalice with my high elves. I often wonder if, uh, you know, I should have just scored quickly against the Skaven, because my team was so good on defense. It'd be very hard for them to stall it, so I could have, like, turned into a shootout. But, um... Never mind. Hello, lad. I might, I might, Mordred. I might do chaffs and high elves, right? Oh, there are about a hundred books for the twenty twenty rules we're on. About a hundred books, yeah. Different places, updates, etc. Yeah, there's there's loads of spikes. There's death zone. There's the rule books itself. There's Loads of FAQs it is an absolute nightmare. Hello, Randy Tan. Yeah, that is it. The final claw pump. Rats, 18 armor breaks to 4. They didn't get to 20, but it was still pretty one-sided. But yeah, that's just Skaven. Classic Skaven things. Um, commiserations to Magic. Congratulations to, to Napruha. Well played by both. Just a couple of minor things by uh, Magic, I thought. And there you go. Punished brutally, as Skaven so regularly do. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. And stay fantastic.